Range fans, Range fans, back at it on the 50-yard line. Hope I don't have to go after it like I did in the previous video. That's right. 50-yard line, folks. Go over to dayattherange.com if you want to join the Captain America Challenge. We've got classes for everybody. You don't have to have some super high-dollar rifle. Uh, we've got a factory class. We've got a vintage class. We've got an open class. We even got a semi-auto class. Bring what you have. We are bringing this country and the world together. One range session at a time, baby. We got the Cheska Brova Berno Model 4. I just could not. I, I, I have to admit something. I have to admit something. Range fans, I'm Mr. Revolver Guy, and I have a problem. The problem is old Nibs over at Walnut and Steel. Every time he shows up with one of those vintage rifles, I go looking for one. No, it's not a one-up competition. The guy's a really nice guy. It's not a one-up competition at all. But, but the bug has me bad. The vintage bug has me bad. So I decided to come back out with RWS 50. For those of you that follow the channel, you know the Cheska Brova Model 4 is fairly new to me, but this one's been around since 1958. It's even got an all-American 20X Perma Center Lyman Scope sitting on top. We're going to take another run at the old vintage class, this time with the Berno Model 4. I think I have another one out there with the Berno. Maybe it's the first one or the first outing of this one, but not with RWS 50. I honestly don't know how this thing's going to group, how it's going to shoot. I took five rounds and put it on another target just to see where this thing is going to hit, and I'm glad I did because, man, it was shooting about three inches high. Does that mean this ammo is hot over what I was shooting in it before? I don't know. And by the way, I also apologize for the camera setup. I keep leaving my tripod at home. So I got an old Joby tripod with my cell phone uh, sitting in this thing and a, and a little cell phone clip. We'll, we'll see how this comes out. I'll get it together, folks. I'll get it together and uh, hopefully get some good footage for you all when I get my tripod situation all squared away and stop leaving it. Here we go. I get two ciders, and then I go for it. Oh, boy. This might be a long rain session. Whoo! I thought it was going to group better than that. Light trigger on this thing. The spring has been changed in it, I believe. I know it didn't come from the factory that way. I'm not the original owner. Oh, boy. Maybe I should just stick to what the owner told me um, to SK Rifle Match. Of course, I love trying the different stuff. But here we go. It is kind of windy out. Shot low. Oh, ho, ho. Yep, just don't like it. Don't like it. Don't like it, but you know what? Boy, Nibs is gonna be hard to beat shooting like this because I think he shot an 85. Pretty much all fours and I think one star. That is a star in the middle. That blue center, old stars and stripes, baby. <laughs> uh, here we go.
Nope. Uh. Berno just doesn't like RWS 50. This RWS 50, it's high dollar stuff too. And I mean, none of my rifles just seem to like it. I, I actually picked it up because, um, what is it, Anschutz, I believe, test their rifles before they leave the factory with this stuff. So some of those targets you see from those nice and shoots are done with this stuff. Uh, not working out so good for me in any of my rifles. If you've had better luck with it, let me know down below. Man, I don't even want to count up this target. Is the wind getting at me? Yeah. Nibs, I think you're safe this time. Woo! You know what? This is part of the beauty of shooting 22 long rifle. Yes. Am I chasing it? I'm absolutely chasing it. But that's part of the fun. Kind of like dating, right? That first date, you chase it, you chase it. Unless you like my beautiful wife and she don't even speak to you for a year or so. <laughs> I got to get a couple fives. I can do it too. Oh, that was close. Oh, my rest done ran out of room, folks. Bad control. Now, one thing, this rifle probably has the sweetest trigger of all my rifles. Almost embarrassed to say that. I mean, I could kind of see in the vapor trail like this. It's like it's dropping off really something weird. It's so thick out today after a thunderstorm not long ago. Oh, no, but you know what? We going to count them. Anyways, let's go down range. Cheska Brova, Berno, Model 4, RWS 50. Throw this stuff in the lake. <laughs> All right, range fans, here we go. Woo, the rain about to come in on me. Three, four, two, four. Three, three, two, two. Three, four, three, four. Four, four, three, four. Three, two, three, three. Total. 16, 17, 13, 
17 for a total of 63 for the Cheska Brova Berno Model 4 with RWS 50. Come on over to dayatherange.com. Nibs, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Nibs. I can't go home like that. I got some Ely match and one last target. We're going at it. Hold on, folks. Oh, boy, I'm sorry I have to do this with my cell phone. I hope this thing's coming out right. Uh, anyways, here we go. Man, the wind is picking up. We got thunderstorms coming in. I'm going to see, whew, in a rush, if I can get this thing done, I got to do better than 63 with the Cheska Brova Berno Model 4. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I get two ciders. We got Ely Match, folks. Settle in, big fella. That ain't good. That might be better. <laughs> hey. All right. Come on, Berno, give me a five. I gotta have a couple stars to at least beat his score. I either have to top his score by number or tie his score and have more stars. Go over to dayattherange.com, check out the leaderboard. You'll see how we're doing this thing. We count the score and also, whew, that is a big ant. We count the score and also the stars for tiebreakers. You know what? That's me. In a rush. Oh, it's raining. Oh, it stopped raining. Interesting. I'm noticing something here. I'm not going to say anything just yet, but I think I know what's going on. And it has to do with me. Here's what I'm noticing. Exactly where my crosshairs end from a recoil perspective is where that round lands. So I think it is my old trigger finger screwing this thing up, folks. And Nibs at home watching, hoping I continue to screw it up. I'm getting close to those fives, Nibs. I'm getting close. I'm, on, I'm nipping at your heels, buddy. You wonder who I'm talking about? It's good old Nibs over at Walnut and Steel. YouTube channel. Oh, wait a minute. 
That's in there, baby. That's in there. <laughs> oh, nibs, here I come. I think this Berno likes that Ely match. If I do my part and keep it from hopping around on the bench. Oh no, close but no cigar. Close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Whew. Uh, let's ring out a five. Let's ring out a five, big fella. Let's get a five right here. Might as well have been throwing a hand grenade. <laughs> Let's go down and see how we fared. I still don't think I got his score. Nibs, might be time for the Kimber 82G to come out. What do you think? Oh, come on, Range fans. Come on over to dayatherange.com. You see the challenge. Go look at that leaderboard. And by the way, support dayatherange.com. We got some beautiful mugs on the previous challenge. We handed out 10 mugs. We handed out a lot of stuff. I don't know that I'm going to have any sponsors for this particular one. We will see. Maybe we will. This particular challenge is going to go until the end of summer. Let's go down range. Range fans, let's count them up. Let's see what this Berno did. A little bit better showing with the Ely match ammunition, but still not quite nibs caliber or not quite ready just yet. Giving the plus one there because I did get a five. Four, 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 three, 19. Four, 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 three, four, 19. Four, 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 20. Four, three, those threes killed me. Four, five plus one with a star right there. And four, four, a 20. That's a total score of 78 plus one star, folks. So there you have it. Not quite Nibs ready, uh, but so far, the vintage class is heating up. Nibs, I'm sorry, I don't mean to make this a competition. It really isn't. Just having a little fun with you, buddy. Hope you don't take offense to it. Just love the participation in the challenge. Come on, get out and shoot. This thing's going to the end of September. We got a lot of time, and Josh, I haven't called you out in a long time, buddy, and you've been avoiding me. You've been avoiding me. It's time to get the Captain America Challenge over at Pursuit of Accuracy. Come on, let's go.